here and the intention is just to fly through the gorge and then out into the vicinity of Palmerston North. The wind turbines up on the top of the hill so all of the hazards and obstacles which might be uh, have an effect on our uh, flying operations are all modelled in the simulator. Um, so that includes all of the high tension power wires, masts, It's fully day, night and NVG capable. It allows us to train with the night vision goggles as well. We landed close with a lot of vehicles parked around us so they can all be put into the visual scene and they can be given doctrine which governs where they manoeuvre and how they respond. You can make some of them hostile to this aircraft and so they will, they will track and then target the aircraft and if they have weapon systems they can also fire. So that means in the aircraft we get all of the simulation of our defensive aids be it a, a radar, laser, warning. Uh, we can also simulate battle damage to the helicopter and system malfunctions and so that it then gives the crew the opportunity to train how they will deal with those situations, the immediate emergency handling considerations and then how they would then continue to conduct their mission.